As we get ready for Get You Move in March, we're joined by someone who, it seems, never stops moving. We have Miss Idaho, Reagan Yamauchi. Reagan, so much, I see you everywhere. You're all over, you're doing all these things, you're going all these places. You're an easy person to get moving. We're going to talk about getting everybody else moving. And you do something, and tell me how this started. Tell me the genesis of this for something that you do on your social media platforms on Mondays. I love that. So if you follow at Miss America ID or my personal page at Reagan Yamauchi, you'll find that every single Monday I'm post posting Motivated to Move Monday. And it stemmed before I went to Miss America. And really, I was, I, I was trying to think of a way to get people moving fast, easy, quick, it was two minutes. So my videos are not long and they're really just quick hitters to help okay. people get out of their seats. Okay, and so what are some of the things that we can do, let's say, um, because there's all sorts of different moving challenges that you can do. What are just a couple, two or three things that people can do to initially get moving, and then let's say somebody who, like you, moves a lot, what can they do to increase their movement? I think if you're talking very basic, I think everyone's biggest problem is just standing up. We just sit in our chairs, we sit on our sofas, we sit on our couches. Like we're doing right now. <laughs> <laughs> we're so, Maybe we should stand up and do some moving <laughs> while we're doing this interview. Stand up. Yeah. So <laughs> it's very sedentary, this world we live in. Sure. And so I think that if we could just stand up, that's huge. Once you get off your chair, you'll find it's a lot easier to go for a walk. You can get off your chair and you can start, I mean, there's all sorts of things you can do. You can do dips, you know, hamstrings. You can do step ups on your stool. Those are just really easy if you just want to know how to get started. If you're already at that level where you feel like you just want to go on, like mm. do something more, go for the, go for the stairs. Don't take the elevator. Stairs okay. are easy. Park farther out so you can walk into the store anywhere. Huh. Little things like that. Okay, to increase your movements and step challenge. Do you use any sort of uh, type of monitoring device, like maybe a watch, a ped pedometer, to kind of track your steps? Yes, love my Apple Watch. So okay. I recommend just ways to motivate yourself. The Apple Watch always saying, stand up. This is how many steps yep. you have for the day. That really helps motivate you. And so kind of setting goals maybe, you know, don't, you know, if you haven't done a, a movement routine, don't set 30,000 or 80,000 right. steps a day, right. baby step into it. Baby For step sure. into your steps. For so. sure. I love that. <laughs> and so what should we do as far as like walking? I mean, yeah, granted the weather is not conducive to walking outdoors, but you can walk around your house, can't you? Absolutely. I think that obviously right now we're moving into spring and spring's huge, right? Healthy Cities released their Move Spring Challenge. Find ways like that to get a team that motivates you. Okay. So having other people, obviously inside you can do HIIT workouts. I love that online, all you have to do is Google something as long as you want. You want 10 minutes, 10 minute core workout. You want HIIT workout, 20 minutes, you're done. Fantastic. Well, you can follow Reagan on her social media channels and you can also go to Healthy City USA on Facebook and get all that great information as well. Thank you so much, Thanks. Reagan.